Hello everyone. I'm going to talk to you today about how to put your two fish together to make the kite. Now, you might need some supplies like a toilet paper roll. If you are at home, you should have one because we packed them. You're going to need some glue. It could be glue stick, liquid glue, or some tape might work. You could use string or a pipe cleaner for the hanging part. If you don't have that, that's okay. You don't have to have that. You could also have something like a hole punch or you could ask someone at home to help you poke a hole here to hang it with. Some other tools that might help, a stapler might help, and some tape. So let's talk about how to put them together and then you can think about what you might need or use at your own house. So I'm going to take a look at these fish and you can see that the way that they line up is just like this. So if you put your two fish together, you're going to be able to see just how they line up. You're going to want to attach your top fins together. Now, if you're using glue, you're going to have to give it time. It's going to need time to dry. If you are going to use tape and tape those together, it won't need time to dry. If you have a stapler, like me, you definitely don't need any time to dry. So I'm kind of using the stapler to speed up this process. If you have to use glue, that's okay. I'm going to get these two fins together, okay? I'm going to put my tube on the inside. If you would like, you can put a little glue on your tube. Doesn't have to be a lot, ooh, it's gonna roll. Doesn't have to be a lot of glue, just on the opposite side. So here's this side, and then here's this side, okay? When I open this up, I can lay this in here and then wrap this around. Now this might be a little tricky if you have to, if you have to use glue, you might need to help hold this together. Now how could you hold it together if you have glue? Well, you could find something heavy to put on top of it while it dries, like a book or something like that. That could help it stay together. You could find a paper clip and hold it together um, while it's drying. Again, if you have tape or a stapler, that will be more of an instant together. So that's why I'm doing this for the video, just so that we can speed through. But it's top fin together, even if you have to wait, tube on the inside, and then the bottom fins together, okay? And that's how we get that rounded shape. If you really have a lot of trouble with the tube on the inside, don't worry about that. Just glue the two fish together. It's really okay if that's easiest for you or if that's what you would like to do. That's okay. This is just a way to make it a little bit more round. You can see my little fin. Any, if any of this is happening to you, you can just take a little bit more glue and start to fix it. Again, glue takes time to dry, so I might have to wait a little bit or flip it over. Now let's talk about, yeah, see it's sticking up. I'll have to flip it over in a minute. Let's talk about poking a hole. If you have um, a sharp pencil and an adult with you, you can have them help you with that. If you have a hole punch, that's great. I have a, happen to have a hole punch. If you have string, you can hang string through there. Now, if you don't have a hole punch, you could tape string on the inside. You could do it that way. Again, these are just some ways that I'm kind of showing you what to do. For this, I have a pipe cleaner. I'm going to stick that in and wrap it around. But again, you could use string. You can come up with other creative ways. You guys are super creative at home. And here we have our fish kite. Pretty cool. If you have anything like tissue paper at home. Maybe if you have um, gift box, like gift bags that you get tissue paper out of, you can even create some streamers 
So you can get a pair of scissors and cut some of that paper, tissue paper, into like a long skinny rectangle. You don't need a whole bunch. Make sure you ask anything you're using that's extra at home. You could even use pieces of colored paper and you can put these on the inside. I like to put a little glue on the inside, put my tissue paper on top. Maybe I do four pieces and then it gives it a really nice little streamer at the end. So that's how you put together your fish kite. Can't wait to see them. Enjoy and stay creative.